good morning. My name is Alvin Jones. I'm the Police and Crime Commissioner uh, for North Wales. Um, previously, I was a police officer for 30 years with the North Wales Police. And during that time, I formed my opinions around um, um, drug laws and what needs to, um, to happen to, to make things uh, better. I'm on the record as being in support of fully regulating all drugs that are currently uh, prohibited. Um, I believe that one of the reasons we have increases in crime, especially violence crime, is because of um, prohibition uh, and um, enforcement, um, drug law enforcement, uh, which is causing major problems in this country at this time. Um, I appreciate that with an intransi intransigent government, we are not going to um, regulate overnight. So I'm therefore in favour of um, gradual uh, progressive drug policy um, using enhanced um, drug consumption rooms uh, for those people who are problematic use um, because the numbers that die in this country from drug overdoses is uh, unacceptably high and it's time that we got to grips with it. Um, in Portugal um, we, we have 11 times as many um, deaths per million in this country as they do in Portugal who have um, decriminalised all drugs and I think that we should be going in, the, in, in that direction. Um, I also think that we should um, regulate cannabis um, because we, we have a problem at the moment with uh, new psychoactive substances. The problem has much increased since we passed the legislation uh, to make it an offence to possess and supply psychoactive substances. I'm firmly of the belief that um, had we regulated cannabis 30 years ago, we wouldn't be having this problem of psychoactive substances like spice and mamba on our streets today. The Netherlands don't have it and that's a reflection on their progressive uh, drug policy. I'm also concerned about the sheer level of violence that we're seeing in this country and the new business model um, for um, by organised crime. And I mean specifically exploitation of vulnerable people um, to supply drugs um, across the country. Most forces are affected by county lines and cuckooing. Um, basically county lines is using young young people to move to um, rural areas to, to supply drugs on behalf of organised crime groups from, from the cities. That is a form of modern slavery and exploitation and um, organised crime groups are also exploiting vulnerable people by taking over their homes and use it as a base to, to supply drugs. This, um, this and associated with this is an increase in, in violence, including knife violence, um, and I think we really need, need to get to grips with, with this. And uh, prohibition and enforcement of strict drug laws is not the way forward. And um, instead of more of the same, which is in the serious violence strategy, we need to rethink um, our approach to how we deal with drugs and to make it a, a public health issue or um, a regulatory issue, the same as we do with alcohol.